we're farming 500 Dorset ewes, 200 Devon cows, and also do 500 acres in a rotation. It's pole Dorset and Dorset horn, so we've got 450 pole Dorset ewes and near enough 50 Dorset horn ewes. The main thing about the Dorset and the thing that attracted me to them was that they're very docile, very quiet, so easy to keep in, and they have a very tight fleece, a high valuable fleece, so they cope with the winter weather a lot better than you would think, even though they're a, a southern breed. And we normally shear the first week of April, so that would be 700, 750 that we would shear once a year. It's a management thing more than anything. Historically, it was for the value of the wool. You're in Wiltshire, there's plenty of towns built on wool. Now it pays the shearer. You, you need to take the wool off the ewes. Some sheep will naturally drop it if you don't shear them. To convert to organic, you have to convert the land first. And whilst you're converting the land, the stock that are on it will convert with it. So it takes two years. We don't spray, we don't fertilise anything so any nutrient that we're putting into the ground is going to be farmyard manure or what, what the animals leave us as they graze it. For the animals um, they would have to be fed organically, they need to have gone through the process of, of being either born on an organic farm or the two-year conversion period and even after the two-year conversion period those animals aren't organic it's just their offspring can now be organic. The future for, for my farm is probably our, our son that's where the future's got to, got to be. We've been increasing our production and our numbers for the last four or five years since he came home. Uh, we've probably got the numbers to where we want them. We're trying to improve what we're doing um, all the time and improve the arable side of things and the quality of the sheep and the quality of the cattle.